I'm Megan and you're watching Fabulous TV Patia. Today I'm here on the beautiful island of Gotsi Chang. It's only 30 kilometers north of Patia, which is about a 40 minutes drive in the car. Also a 40 minute boat ride, which costs only 50 baht, making it a great place to come for a day out. So come on, let's see how we get here and what there is to do on the beautiful island of Gotsi Chang. Got Si Chang, also known as Ko Si Chang, is located around 30 kilometers north of Pattaya, with the ferry departing from Sira Cha City. Once you reach Sira Cha, the best way to get to the ferry is by Tuk Tuk. This is the most popular transportation around the city, and parking at the ferry is limited. Ferry tickets to the island cost only 50 baht per person per way. Boats depart hourly in high season and every two hours in low season. The boat ride to the island takes around 40 minutes and there are life jackets on board for your safety. Now sit back, relax and take in the beautiful views. You'll be there in no time. Upon arriving at Koh si Chang Island, there's a tourist information desk and an island map with all the information you need to help plan your adventure. The most convenient way to get around would be to rent a motorbike, costing around 80 baht an hour, 250 baht for the day, or 300 baht overnight. If you prefer not to drive, you can hire a tuk-tuk with a driver to take you to the most popular hotspots for only 250 baht. The first stop on the island is the beautiful multi-level Chinese temple, set up high on the cliff. Tram rides to the top are available for the elderly and disabled. Once reaching the top, you'll be faced with the most spectacular, breathtaking views overlooking the bay. Here, you'll also be able to explore the Shrine Caves, which date back to the days when Chinese traders anchored in the sheltered waters. This is a very popular spot for people to come to meditate, pray and wish for good fortune when visiting the island. Outside, visitors let off firecrackers to scare away bad spirits. Join us again tomorrow when we visit the most popular hotspots and beautiful beach on the paradise island of Ko Si Chang. Coming up next, Patia Mail, taking you on a road trip. Guten Tag. Здравствуйте. Sowatika. With Easy ABC, you can quickly learn German, English, Russian or Thai in either our group or individual courses. We'll have you speaking Thai after only two months. Why not see for yourself with our free trial lesson? Google Easy ABC Patia. Easy ABC, your language school in South Patia and Naglua. Welcome to Easy ABC. There, Jeff Carr today on the outskirts of Pattaya. In fact, about 30 minutes away uh, down the Scumbit Road. And today I'm at the Nung Nut Gardens and I'm going to show you around all the beautiful things to see and do. 
at these archways. Look at that. So there's even a car made out of plant pots. It just shows you, doesn't it? If you put your mind to it, you can make anything. All these wonderful plants here, all growing without soil. They've all got aerial roots. Look, absolutely beautiful. Oh, hang on, look at all the parrots. Wow, I didn't see them coming, did you? Look at them. And I've not even gone inside where the gardens are yet. This is, this is just where you park your motorbike. <laughs> Unbelievable, isn't it, eh? Look at that. Wouldn't you like just get in there now and cool off? And here now is all the elephants. And I presume these take people on rides around the gardens. There they are, just getting themselves a little bit of food now. Oh, and a nose pipe. This lady's selling bananas now for 40 baht, and you can feed them to the elephants. Look at this lot. And apparently this one time, you know, it was just an old lady who owned an house with big gardens. She had a lot of gardeners, and everybody's saying, I tell you what, love, this is lovely, this. Why don't you open it to the public? So she did years ago. She opened it to the public, and now look what's happened. She's got hundreds of staff every day keeping it all lovely. All absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Never smile at a crocodile, cause a crocodile he never smiles. Just come off the high rise walkway now, and this is unusual. It now looks like we're going into um, a car museum or something like that. So if you're into your cars, it could be worth coming just to have a look at all these cars. Have a look here. Nice and cool in here as well. Now we're talking, we're coming to the proper gardens now, look. British telephone boxes. Then opens up into loads of little temples. And loads of really, really beautiful topiary gardens. Well, there we have it, I think. The wonderful Nung Nook Gardens just on the outskirts of Pattaya. And um, there's loads more videos coming soon. So uh, the main thing is, keep smiling. Hey, trouble, trouble and strife. Hey, sorrow, won't you be my wife? The man who set a bomb, injuring 21 people at an army-run hospital earlier this year, was sentenced to 27 years in prison for crimes included attempted murder yesterday. The 62-year-old politically driven engineer saw his sentence reduced from life as he confessed to his crimes. Non-ties without valid visas are being targeted by immigration right now. Visits to bars and diners during the daytime have seen officers checking passports and tourists are reminded that carrying at least a copy of your passport and visa entry is a requirement here in Thailand. Flooding continues in the south of Thailand with official figures now recognizing that some 15 people have been killed in the past two weeks. Patani, Yala, Songkla and Trang have all seen heavy storms and flooding and trains on the Bangkok to Nakhon Si Tamarat route were being stopped early yesterday too. Meanwhile, at home and in Pattaya, the 44-year-old Thai man responsible for a road wreck that saw two killed and numerous injured in Pattaya, Thai, 
was in court last night, seeing police object to any bail. Associated with a late-night bar in Walking Street, it was declared that blood tests revealed illegal substances despite his claims that he'd suffered a fit while driving. Smoking zones are being tested on John T.M. Beach, seeing sand lovers told off for puffing on the sand. The trial is ahead of any plans to impose fines on smokers on many beaches throughout the nation from February onwards. The World Jet Ski Championships kicked off in John Tien yesterday, seeing competitors from several dozen nations all splash and bounce in Patias Bay. Free to watch, the competition runs through to the weekend. A combined police and immigration raid on the homes of several Westerners on the east side yesterday saw four men arrested and warrants issued for another four who are now being sought. With plans afoot to deport all, Two of those nabbed are said to have failed drug tests. The raid was a result of a long-term investigation and followed claims that all had been involved in underhand behaviour. And other groups of less than desirable individuals are being warned that they too are in the crosshairs of the authorities. There's always good and bad here, and good came to the surface yesterday, seeing a taxi driver return to the place where he dropped off a Russian tourist to hand back a wallet that he'd found in his cab. And with the Met Office promising highs today of around 32, dropping down to 25 tonight, that is the local and national news from Fabulous 103 FM. First every day with news on TV and radio in English language and keeping you in touch with Thailand along with Pattaya, the city of fun. BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football. Hello, this is Adi Adidoyne at the BBC Sports Centre. Felipe Coutinho scored a hat-trick as Liverpool became the fifth English club to qualify for the last 16 of this season's Champions League. They beat Spartak Moscow 7-0 at Anfield to qualify as group winners. Salah must score, does score! Liverpool make it seven! Incredible! It's now 23 goals they've scored in this Champions League group. The most any English side have ever scored in a single Champions League group. And Liverpool marching on as group winners and into the knockout stages for the first time since 2009. So how far can Liverpool go in the competition? Here's the former England international, Chris Waddle. They just look a yard quicker all over the park than every team they've played. Uh, all right, the Seville game, they came off the pace and they end up with a draw. But uh, most games you watch Liverpool play, they just look so quick. They look so confident on the ball. They're so relaxed. The weight of pass is great. You know, if you want to squeeze them and say, don't let them play out, all of a sudden they can just hit one over the top. They've got the pace of any striker they've got. They've all got good pace and they can stretch you very quickly. Manchester City were beaten for the first time this season, losing 2-1 to Shakhtar Donetsk. Tottenham beat Arpo Nicosia by three goals to nil. Both English Premier League teams though, had already qualified as group winners. John Southall watched the Spurs game. Yeah, it's a very comfortable night for Tottenham. They've beaten Apoel Nicosia by the same scoreline they did over in Nicosia earlier in the year by three goals to nil. Lorente and Som with the first two in the first half. And then George Kevin and Kudu with his first goal for the club made it three. Good goal, cutting in from the left-hand side. Took a deflection, but certainly his goal, and he'll remember that. His first for Tottenham on just his third start for the club. Very comfortable, as I say. And for more football news from the BBC, go to bbc.com forward slash football. BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football. Coming up next, fabulous food. We are Bubble Spa Patio, promising affordable relaxation in your own home anytime you choose. Located on Tepresit Road, opposite the Outlet Mall.
coming up next on Fabulous TV Patia. La Costa by L'Italiano is a stunningly beautiful Italian restaurant offering traditional pizzas, pastas, and authentic Italian cuisine, alongside fresh seafood and the best dishes from Thailand, too. Twelve years in Pattaya, La Costa by L'Italiano promises an outstanding lunch or dinner experience. Find us on Beach Road at the front of the LK Empress Hotel next to Soy 12. Check us out on Facebook. La Costa by L'Italiano, Pattaya's premier Italian restaurant. Megan and you're watching Fabulous TV Patia. Today we are here at the Kaukio Open Zoo. It's a really fantastic and a very popular zoo located not far from Patia. I really love this place because it's not like the regular zoos where all the animals are kept away in these small cages, but this is an open zoo. They have a night safari and all the animals are out in the open. You should come and check it out for yourselves. Let's have a look. Kaukio Open Zoo is located around a 45 minute drive from Pattaya City in Bangpra Chomburi. Established in 1974, the zoo covers a total of 2,000 acres and is home to more than 8,000 animals from over 300 species. Supported by Thailand's princess Maha Chakri Sirimthorn in the expansion of the zoo over the years in aid of rescuing injured animals and wildlife, giving them a safe and natural environment to live in. many ways to travel around the park. Sit back, relax and hop on and off the free tram ride service. Golf carts are available to rent or you can drive around the park in your car. Enjoy the beauty of the natural forests and up close encounters with the wild animals by day or join the after dark night safari. At Kaukio Open Zoo, you'll be sure to enjoy a real jungle-like experience with all kinds of animals from zebras, giraffes and elephants to flamingos and kangaroos. A great day out for all the family. Coming up next, Fit and Fabulous, your daily one-minute workout. The referees can't decide who the winner should be in the big match between Retox versus Retox Game On. Retox in Soy Lenki is the sports bar with more, and more of those specials, like the 98-bat breakfast and daily Brexit specials. Retox Game On in Soy Honey is the brand new sports bar with 50 TVs, including one at your own table, plus the surprise of a new menu and seating for 200 for any match, day or night. The battle continues 24 hours a day. Try Retox and Retox Game On, then you decide. <laughs> Hey everybody, whether you're active or you're not, drinking water and staying hydrated and paying attention to your hydration levels is incredibly important to everybody. We've all heard it before, of course, that drinking water is good for your health, but do we actually take it to heart? Think on this for a second. 
Whether you believe in science or creationism, the fact remains that one of the essentials for life on this planet is water. All life, as we know it, on Earth dies without water. For example, the average human can survive up to a month without food in an emergency situation, but roughly only a week without water. That's how important it is. So with that said, here's an easy tip to ensure you're staying hydrated and getting enough water. You've probably heard eight glasses a day, two liters a day, etc., etc. Let's keep it simple. Everyone is different, so they require different amounts. Just pay attention to your urine. If it's clear like water, you're reasonably hydrated. If it's dark yellow or doesn't smell so good, you're dehydrated. Vitamins might make your pee a little brighter yellow. Always pay note to your hydration levels, especially when you're living in warmer climates like Thailand. Like I said, it's very important to stay hydrated. So with that said, pay attention to how much water you've drank today. Next time you go to the restroom, are you hydrated? You tell me. Go and check right now after watching this show. So until next time, you guys stay healthy, stay happy. Coming up next, find out what's happening in the city before it happens, so you can be there, not just read about it afterwards. Let's have a look at some of the special events and promotions coming up around Pattaya today and this coming week. Every Sunday out at Bangsaray Beach Club, indulge in a delicious Sunday roast while admiring the beautiful views of Bangsaray Bay. On the beachfront at the Bangsaray Beach Club, you can enjoy this meal for just 350 baht per plate and desserts start at 75. Available every Sunday, kicking off at 1. An excuse to enjoy the beach while watching sports this year? Head down to John Tien Beach on the 7th through to the 10th of December to see the Thai Airways-sponsored International Jet Ski World Cup 2017. Three days of exciting competitions in spectacular entertainment with top jet ski riders from around the world competing for the cup, something that you won't want to miss. It's the biggest jet ski tournament in the world and it's taking place right here in Pattaya City. Why not enjoy a romantic evening under the stars while sipping on fine wines from the Monsoon Valley Winery? That's all taking place at the Sala Rim Nam restaurant at the Avani Patia Resort and Spa on Second Road on Friday the 8th of December. Running from 7 until 9.30, the evening is priced at only 999 baht per person and promises to be an outstanding event. Something for golfers as we invite you to hit the road and join the Outback Bar golfing team. That's on their Kanchanaburi golfing trip. A fun excursion playing the fantastic Nikanta course, two rounds of golf at Grand Prix and a round at the Army course, as well as a bit of exploring history for the Second World War and a cruise on the River Kwai. Four nights, four rounds from the 12th to the 16th of December, for details, contact the Outback Bar on Soy Siam Country Club Road for more information. A day not to be missed is the Take Care Kids Fun Day down at the Sea Falcon Hotel. A fun day out for the whole family with a free barbecue supplied by Nikki's Restaurant and a bouncy castle, face painting and a magic show. Funds raised all go to a good cause, the abused children at the Take Care Kids Foundation. That starts at midday on Saturday the 16th of December. If you're looking for the least expensive lunch in the city, why not check out the Mediterranean Garden Resort at Lake Maprachan? With pizzas from only 99 baht, Thai food from 79 baht, and puddings starting at 19 baht. They're available every day from 12 noon until 3 o'clock, and the Mediterranean Garden Resort is in the village of Pong. At some point in life, you really fancy being pampered, 
and a great place to be pampered is the Moven Pixie Am Hotel. The Sunset Thai Massage is daily from 5 till 7 at the Wave Spa. That's out at the beachfront where you can lay down, relax and unwind for an hour of deep massage, priced at 1,200 baht per person. It's a good idea to book ahead. Head over to the East Coast Kitchen Restaurant at the Holiday Inn Patia Hotel and treat yourself to a seafood barbecue buffet feast. Priced at only 999 baht, net per person, and children under the age of 12, well, they eat for free. The buffet takes place between 6 and 10 every Thursday, Friday and Saturday evening and they recommend advanced reservations. Enjoy a romantic moonlit dinner experience under the stars in effort of supporting Earth Hour. That's at the Sala Rim Nam, the Thai traditional restaurant at the Avani Patia Resort. Located beside the Lotus Ponds, that takes place every Friday between 7 and 10 in the evening, with a special 20% discount throughout the whole of the month of August. Kick off your weekend in style with magnificent 360-degree panoramic views of the sun setting over the bay, whilst listening to the hottest beats by a live DJ. Every Friday and Saturday evening, you can join us at the Rooftop Terrace in Holiday Inn Patia Hotel. And you can also enjoy a special buy one, get one free on all beverages. If you enjoyed us, click like on our Facebook page. And don't forget to come back again tomorrow for another episode. Because we're different.